You look so angry. Is that how you looked when you killed my husband? Maybe you came out here to kill me too, is that it? Here. I believe you're familiar with blunt objects. Hit me with your best shot. Come on, what are you waiting for? Take it. Don't do it, Randy. Go away. We're down the brick, Randy. She keeps coming back. And back. You won't listen. You won't stop. Go ahead. Make me stop. This isn't the answer. Walk away, Randy. For Frankie, for your family. She's not worth it. No, you should go. Did the Hubbards get to you? Tell you what a big bad girl I am. So mean to poor sweet Randy. The Hubbards are good people. No way they had anything to do with your husband's death. The good people obviously didn't tell you everything. What are you still doing here? Where's Randy? Oh, your friend can tell you all about it. I'm sure he can't wait. Me? Oh, I've had enough excitement for one night. You really do have wonderful hands. See you soon. What happened? Was Randy up here? Yeah, she was. She was just about to bash in Madison's head with that brick down there until I stopped her. Damn. Well, thanks for stopping her. Fr Frankie... What the hell is going on, man? Why would Adam say Stuart's name? Hey, I was wondering where you had gone off to. I almost did it. I almost killed her. I had a brick in my hand. She dared me. She gave it to me, and Madison dared me to hit her. I almost killed her like Henry. No, you hit Henry in self-defense. He attacked you. Yeah, I keep telling myself that was self-defense, Angie. But, but was it? Maybe, maybe I wanted him dead. Maybe I wanted him dead just the same way I wanted my past dead. Maybe I'm a murderer. You're not a killer. I know you and Jesse think that Madison might have killed him, but I... No, no, but, but nothing. No matter what Madison did, Henry North attacked you. You protected yourself. You protected your baby. You had every right to do what you did. I overreacted. No, no, you know what? I would have done the same thing. There are too many women who do not fight back. I see it in the ER all the time. Black eyes, broken bones, and those are just the lucky ones. So many are too afraid to stand up for themselves. Sweetheart, you have nothing to feel guilty about. You did what had to be done in that moment. God knows what would have happened if you hadn't. Henry would still be alive. You don't know that. Look, if you question yourself, if you doubt yourself, if you convince yourself that you are no better than the life you left behind, then Henry North will have won. Do you understand? Defended yourself against Henry North because you are a strong woman. And tonight you walked away from his wife for the same reason. So let me get this right. Randy left North in a hotel room injured. And when she came back, he was dead. There's a time gap. Someone could have come in and killed North and then left. That's exactly what we suspect. So, and you think it could have been Madison? Well, I know it was. 
So the grieving widow's not only a killer, but she's trying to pin the murder on Randy and then putting your family through hell? You don't seem surprised by the theory. I was chief interrogator with my unit in Iraq. I know faces. I know what they're feeling. I know what they're hiding. From what I saw in Madison on the rooftop, she's sitting on a lot of emotions. And grief wasn't a part of the mix. She's afraid and she's acting out to cover. Now, now all we need is the evidence to prove. Yeah. <clears throat> well, this man talk seems like all kinds of fun. But if we don't hit the dance floor, we're going to be disqualified. Come on. Right. Hey, hey. Thanks. Really. Man's got the heart of a cop. You know, it's kind of nice dancing with you when you're awake. What were you talking to my dad and brother about? Nothing. They were just filling me in on Madison North. Just like that? They kept me in the dark forever. And they just kind of stumbled into it. They didn't miss a step. Good police work. Police work? I mean, I did have a little training in Iraq. Look, whatever you did, you impressed the hell out of my dad. I didn't do anything, okay? I just walked into a situation, I dealt with it, now it's over. Look, we're not going anywhere, Brock. Okay, so why don't you just tell me what you did? Look, all right. Things were heating up between Randy and Madison, so I stepped in. No big deal. Anyone else would have done the same thing that I did. It was just, it, it was just my instinct. That's all it was. My instincts suck. Don't say that. Yeah, I tried to stop Madison and I blew it. I broke a mirror. I gave her even more to use against my family. You know, if Brad didn't stop me. You never would have done it. Because you're not a killer, baby. Look. I think everything happens for a reason, and I'm glad you didn't. With Henry, at least when I hit him, it was a reflex. With Madison, I was really considering doing it. What's happening to me, Frankie? To us, maybe. Madison is poison. She's crazy. And every time we try to stop her, she just comes back stronger. On that rooftop, holding that brick. It's weird. I felt in control, but at the same time, out of control. Yeah, I've been there. And it's the out of control part that scares me. You think I'm a... Look at us, rocking the pledges. I bet your army boys are digging deep in those pockets for those dollars. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it couldn't possibly be any of my friends from the police academy. Uh, yeah, I'm sure it is, yeah. You think the academy is easy? You're military, so you think it's a piece of cake. You should join, Brat. I dare you. Let's see those instincts kick in. How well you handle psychological training, marksmanship. Whoa, 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 hold on. Marksmanship? Are you serious? <laughs> How many guns have you fired? Plenty. Oh, so after a nice latte in the morning, you swing by the range for a little target practice? I bet you those paper men are just shaking when you show up. Look, I know you ain't dissing me. All I'm saying is, I fired more guns, more kinds of guns, at all kinds of targets. <laughs> so you think you're better? Oh, fine. Great. Be better. You know what? Do you want?